The intrigue of Tommy Lahren, you know the story. Yes, uh, that she had been suspended over at the Blaze uh, after she made the comment on The View where she said that uh, she believed in women having the right to choose. Um, and that did not go over well with some people over at the Blaze. Well, here's what we're hearing, because it's actually a little more complicated than that. Um, the people, I, I was on the phone this morning on this, and the people over at the Blaze, I am told, um, their position is this, it's gotten really nasty. She's leaving the Blaze. Um, from their perspective, they are saying that she's a traitor, they're saying she's crazy, they're saying she was never a good fit now that's kind of odd to say she's never a good fit because she was the face of the blaze for a long time. And, Along with Glenn but Beck. She yeah. was clearly the breakout star. She was star. the face of the blaze to a degree larger than Glenn Beck. It, I think so. It's, it's not even close. Not even close. Mm -hmm. it, like, I agree. Like she, Tommy Lauren, the, the success she was able to kind of have at the blaze, she became a viral internet star. She became a cross-cultural media star. She did a lightning last, rod. Yeah, a lightning rod. It was the last time you saw Glenn Beck doing a daily. No, show. it's true, yeah. and 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 she is sought after now because she's good television. If you don't, even if you don't agree with her, right. so we are told that on her side, the feeling is that this was jealousy on Glenn Beck's part and other and the part of others because she clearly is the breakout star. So what's happened is she has six months left in her contract, we're told. She, uh, the, the, the Blaze was willing to pay her off, at, but they were gonna bench her for the six months so she couldn't get another job. She didn't like that. She was saying, you can't fire me for cause, and so, because I didn't do anything wrong to get fired, so we're told they're negotiating right now, and the way it's gonna work is she will get something less than six months of her remaining salary, but she will be able to go out and find another job. It should be done this week. The question is, where will Tommy Lahren land? I think there, mm. there's no shortage of places that will love her right now. I think that there's a huge, huge opening for her over at Fox because Megyn Kelly is gone, and, I, and she had been doing more appearances on the O'Reilly Factor anyway, but I am still floored that it is ending like this at the Blaze, the Blaze was poised to take a major step forward in conservative news with her being their linchpin, and for them not to have her, it, it really is shocking well, to me. It shows how how pissed off people over there must have been, or at, like you said, with it, that thinking of her as a traitor. That's, that's the one way of looking at it. But again, there are other ways of looking at it. But you don't, you don't like Van is right. You don't cut off your nose to spite your face that way. Unless, I agree. Like. The anger has to be so intense for you to do something like that. I have one other theory that I get what you're saying about Fox for sure. And by the way, though, uh, Megyn Kelly's role is already filled by Tucker Carlson, and he's doing really well. So, I mean, in fact, I think he's doing better than Megyn Kelly did. Mm -hmm. So that's taken. There's one other option. I was thinking about this. Go for it. She could go to CNN as a regular on a panel because... Mm -hmm. You know, they try. You want to keep her off panels. Huh? You want to keep her off panels. Yeah, panel, panel is not, not her strong, strong suit. Yeah. I mean, not, not to diss Tommy. I'm I not to diss Actually, Van, I disagree. I go Reagan. I've seen her on several panels, and oh, she's gone toe to toe with, guys. like, I, CNN, to my, if I was her agent, I'd be saying, guys, go to What was guys. the one that she was? Uh, she did real time with Bill Maher. Yes, and the Bill she Maher was. was guys, mm, I, it's, was not it's good. Not, yeah, like, she, Tommy's great. She has an unbelievable skill set, but you want her talking in there and being powerful towards the camera. The panel situation is not. Not good for her. I think that I think she would be good television. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I mean, we'll see. I mean, she's, go back, go back, she's go back and watch the appearance. If you watch that, that, that Bill Maher one, she, was, she was buried. Was like, it, was, that, it was terrible. Right. She was in over her head. But you right. got to. She's not but stupid. She can, she's smart, and she's got extreme views. But ultimately, they work best when she's delivering them. But you can't to do the that. Audience you, that accepts you her. can't do that on any cable network. You've got to have some interaction where people disagree with you. So no matter what she does, she's not going to talk to camera for an hour. She's got to interact with people who disagree with her because that's the heat of cable. So at some point, but if it's you do that work. for just one segment of her show, as opposed to an entire show with her doing that, is probably getting in over her head. We will see. I think we're going to see soon. Hey, Lori Hammond, Fort Wayne, Indiana here. Um, I love Tommy and I doubt, I have no doubt at all she's going to land somewhere very cool and it's going to maybe even be a better, better fit. And I think when she made her pro-choice stance, I think it had a lot to do with it wasn't intentional when she said that on The View. So I think it was a little bit of a slip under pressure. And I think that the Glenn Beck knew she probably felt that way, but was told to not say it. And when she did, she got the ax and it wasn't unexpected. 
Um, I'm sure she knew it was coming before it even happened. When she, she, she wanted to, we're happen. told. By the way, we're told when they suspended her, that's when she went to them and said, "I want out of the contract." So she actually went to them. Hmm. Make sure to subscribe to TMZ Live to keep up to date on the latest entertainment news. And if you want to keep watching, click on one of these videos right now.